My name is Dr. Eskeland from Norway. I'm here to share some of the results we have obtained using young tissue extract in studies. Young tissue extract, for short we call it YTEs, is the new formed material from incubated eggs. Those eggs are of course fertilized. The young tissue extract actually increases the sexual hormone level in people with low testosterone or hormone, sexual hormones levels. Um, we also find that using young tissue extract, we have a lower body production of stress hormone. The building materials for stress hormone as well as sexual hormones are identical. It's derivative from cholesterol and on that pathway, on the production, I would refer it to a shunting effect. We get the production to the sexual hormones instead of the stress hormones. I'm here specifically referring to cortisol, the major stress hormone in the body. Through the years, we have uh, done several studies on sexual desire in men as well as women, and we realized those people are, uh, we get increased sexual desire and even the ability to perform sexually. Yes, we have had several studies involved with women, and they have also very positive effect on taking especially the middle-aged women. Women will experience uh, better sexual desire, better uh, self-esteem, for instance, everything about their quality of life, I would say. We can associate that to, uh, I believe, very much to the stress hormone. The body produces less stress hormone, uh, especially cortisol, and we know that cortisol is very, has many catabolic or negative effect on several uh, criteria of uh, like life quality aspects. Yeah, we have also done a, quite a few studies in sport nutrition, even at the University of Oslo, different uh, institutions around the world. And the first uh, thing we realize when using YT in sport nutrition is that we have a lower production of stress hormone generally. That affects especially the restitution time after a, a competition or a training or whatever. We realize that uh, the stamina is increased, also the energy. And go further there, we realize that the self-esteem and the more psychological aspects are very much improved on people uh, using a daily supplement of uh, YTE. There is no negative side effect uh, from using YTE, except that we recommend that people being allergic for egg protein should avoid taking the product. It's made in Norway. We are very fortunate in Norway. It's one of the few countries in the world that we can guarantee the product being salmonella free. It's made at the place Mysen, a smaller place in the east of uh, Norway. The birds are kept inside in houses and uh, very strict hygienic quality measurements are followed up and they are not exposed to migrating birds. In Norway so far we haven't had any incident of bird flu.
No, the, the white tea is not produced from regular breakfast eggs, as you say. It's made from fertilized, partly incubated eggs, and it's very, very um, limited amount of the egg content that is uh, following the YT. This is the new form material made during the uh, incubation time. We know that eggs are rather rich in cholesterol, but here we only use the, the young tissue extract represent only the new form material made during the early incubation of the egg. So there is absolutely no cholesterol in, in young tissue extract.